Imagine a turtle and a watermelon rolling down a hill. The watermelon smashes into pieces, but the turtle, it pulls into its shell and stays safe. Why? Because animals and plants have natural ways to protect themselves from forces, just like buildings and bridges. Some animals have tough armor, some use flexibility, and others have shock absorbers built right into their bodies. Think about how bones work. Just like buildings have strong support beams, animals have skeletons that help them stand, move, and resist forces like gravity. But bones aren't stiff like metal. They can bend a little without breaking. That's because they're made of strong yet slightly flexible material that absorbs impact. Without that flexibility, bones would snap like dry twigs. Some animals take protection even further. Armadillos and turtles have hard shells that protect them from predators and falls. When something pushes or hits them, the force spreads across their shell instead of damaging their body. This is just like how helmets protect people. The hard outer layer absorbs impact, so the softer inside stays safe. Other animals rely on flexibility instead of armor. Think about an octopus. If a wave crashes into a rock, the octopus bends and shifts instead of getting hurt. Some plants use this strategy too. Tall trees and grasses sway in the wind instead of breaking. If they were stiff like stone, strong winds could snap them in half. Some creatures even have built-in shock absorbers. When a cat jumps from a high place, it lands softly instead of crashing down like a rock. That's because its legs bend and spread out the force so it doesn't get hurt. Kangaroos and rabbits also use strong, springy legs to absorb impact when they land. Even small things like insects have ways to handle forces. Many bugs have light but tough exoskeletons that protect them from pressure. If you gently press on a beetle's shell, it doesn't get squished easily because its hard outer shell resists the force. Plants also face forces like wind, rain, and even animals stepping on them. Some, like cacti, have thick rubbery skin to hold water and protect them from damage. Others, like palm trees, have flexible trunks that bend with strong winds instead of snapping. Nature is full of incredible designs that protect against forces. Animals use armor, flexibility, and shock absorption, while plants use strength and movement to survive. The next time you see a turtle, a tree bending in the wind, or a cat landing softly on its feet, remember, they're all using natural engineering to resist forces.